Hello friends. Now when we're children we respect and look up to lots of people don't we? Sometimes it's someone in our family, uh, it may be a teacher or someone like a youth leader. Um, we want to be like them and respect them. They set us an example to follow and show us right from wrong. They may even set us an example of how to live close to God and how to follow his ways. Timothy's faith in the Bible was influenced by his mother and his grandmother. Paul says in Timothy 1 verse 5, I have been reminded of your sincere faith, which first lived in your grandmother Lois and in your mother Eunice, and I am persuaded now lives in you also. Sorry, that's 2 Timothy chapter 1 verse 5. The example of strong faith from Lois and Eunice inspired the faith of Timothy, someone who then spread the good news of God to other people. And back in the Old Testament, Uzziah followed the example set by Amaziah, his father. The Bible says in 2 Chronicles chapter 26 verse 4, he did what was right in the eyes of the Lord, just as his father had done. But even as we get older, we still need good role models in our lives. We need people who can encourage us in our faith, people who can mentor us. And we also need to be good role models for others, to others. We can mentor people younger than us, but we can also simply just live in a Christ-like way to show others the right way to live. And the Bible tells us in Colossians chapter 3 verse 16 to let the message of Christ dwell among you richly as you teach and admonish one another with all wisdom through psalms, hymns and songs from the Spirit, singing to God with gratitude in your heart. When we live according to that verse, that makes us a really good example to everyone that we meet. So I wonder, who has been a great role model in your life? If you can, do something to thank them today. Let's pray. We'll say the Lord's Prayer together. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. <laughs>